What's up, everybody? We're back. Yeah. 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 Hey, hey, welcome back. So we're coming back to a band a few weeks ago. This band is called Crypta. Uh, they got a new song out here called Trial of Traders. This is from their upcoming album, Shades of Sorrow, that's coming out August 4th. Hey, why you guys are here? Go ahead and hit that like, hit the subscribe. Let us know what you think about the song down in the comments. And uh, let us know if there's any other crypto or any other songs we need to be reacting to. Dave, let's do it. Here we go. Or napalm. That was song we did from them was uh, Lord of Ruins, right? Yeah. yeah. That was a good song. That's some low ass. <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> I would say my first impression is I'm enjoying this one more than the previous one. Uh, so far I think Lord of the Ruins, or Lord of the Ruins is so bad. Ooh. Yeah, me too. So far. Yeah, yeah, I, I appreciate it. It's good. I like how they're all in different rooms. Damn. I like that riff or that lick. That uh, guitar solo was definitely done in the uh, Chuck Schuldiner school uh, of solos. Yeah. Well, like the tone of it. Yeah. Even that little lead is very death to me. Yeah. Yeah. You don't hear that just in the main riff. You hear that just in the main riff. Oh shit. Wow. Isn't this the band that got like the guitar player from the from the Brazilian Metallica cover band? Yeah. Somebody pointed me in the comments for saying that last time. I just wanted to get that in here again.
All Dude, right. That was uh that was well above average for me. Um that, I enjoyed that. I agree with you, man. I, I think that was better than Lord of Ruins for me. Yeah. Um, it, it it really makes me uh, excited for their album big time. Really happy with that one. Um definitely enjoyed the guitar solos more in this one than the previous song. Um yeah, good ass fucking riffs. And compared to their last album, it seems like they are taking it more seriously. What do I think of the production on this? I mean, compared to the last one, if you recall last time we thought, you know, the drums kind of had that uh, St. Anger pang yeah. Yeah. Uh, to it. And, I, you know, the, 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 the there was no, like, I, I think we said there was no, like, power or balls to it. I felt like that, that that was there this time. Yeah, I don't know if it was just like the difference in <clears throat> like video or or I, mean, I could be totally stupid and maybe the the drums sound exactly the same as as before. I mean, they're all they're going to be on the same album, so uh, I'm assuming what we're hearing is the album recording. But I was going to bring that up. Like, I thought the drums sounded really good in this song. Now I don't know if it was just the riff that was accompanying it that was better that kind of helped to drive the drum sound, but. Overall, I agree with you, Adrian. I think this was this was much more in my enjoyment wheelhouse. Um, there was nothing wrong with the previous song, I, but I, I think this one was much better for me. I enjoyed the guitar solos more, the main riff. Man, that lead vocalist, like not to be not to be overshadowed. She's really really good, man. She oh, really yeah. like those uh, those high screeching uh, screams that she does. Really really good. Uh, I enjoyed this. I thought this was very good. Hell yeah. Uh, hey, um, well, hold on, hold on just a second, Jason. Hold on a second. Uh, I just want to make sure we give all of our death metal fans a chance to go ahead and, and stop the video now before you have to listen to me or Jason talk about the song. So I just want to make sure everybody leaves on a positive note. Go ahead, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, I liked the, uh, the bass track. I liked the guitar track. I thought the drums were, like you guys are saying, there was a lot more power to it this time uh, than I feel like there was before. And I don't know if that's a combination of the way the drums were as well as the bass, because the bass sounded a lot lower than uh, you, what you would normally hear. Uh, vocals, not my style. Uh, did not enjoy the vocals pretty much at all. Uh, mm. Talented, like I, it, it, it makes my, my throat sore just listening to our screech. It's like my but, favorite style. Uh, yep. I, just, I, I just can't <clears throat> stand it. Mm. Uh, Adrian, I agree. I thought the solos were better in this one um, than the previous track that we listened to from them. But overall, I just, I don't know, man. I just wasn't really into the song as much. There was, there were certainly moments that were interesting, um, but I think largely this, this just wasn't my thing. Um, I don't know. It just felt like any other track on the album. It didn't, like, it just wasn't much standing out to me. I guess I, that's all I would say about it. But. Uh, you know, as Adrian would say, um, there's nothing offensive about the track. Just uh, not really my thing. Fine. Right on. Yep. Hey, well, ho hey, hope you guys liked the video. If you did here, go ahead and give us a like. Give us a subscribe. We're putting out weekly metal content right now. we got metal reactions, metal reviews, and all kinds of other cool shit. And in the meantime, live long and prosper. <clears throat> Take it easy, everybody. See ya. Later. <laughs>